Today, I'd like you to consider this question: Is your English unbalanced? If something is unbalanced, it means it is not equal. It is not even. There is more in one part and less in another part. These pictures show situations that are unbalanced. So, what does it mean for your English to be unbalanced? Well, learning a language has many different aspects. There's reading, writing, listening, speaking, grammar, and vocabulary. If you are strong in some areas but weak in other areas, then your English is unbalanced. For example, some students read a lot, even advanced texts, but they can't understand much when they listen. Some students have a large vocabulary, but they can't put the words they know into phrases when they speak. Some students are great at grammar and can write very well, but have very bad pronunciation, and it's difficult to understand their accent. This is what it means for your English to be unbalanced. And later in this video, I'll give you some tips for solving this problem. But first, take a moment to look at these six aspects of the English language and think about which area you are strongest in and which area you are weakest in. In order to be fluent in English, you need to be good at all the aspects of the language because they are all connected, and all of them are important for fluency. So, how can you balance these areas and improve them all? Here's one suggestion: dedicate one day of the week to working on each area. For example, on Monday, practice reading; on Tuesday, do some writing; on Wednesday, work on your listening. On Thursday, practice speaking. On Friday, study grammar. On Saturday, learn some vocabulary. And on Sunday, you can relax or review what you've learned during the week. This way, you can make progress in all the areas together, and your English level will improve as a whole. Now, in order to study all the aspects of the language, you might have to visit many different websites. For example, reading an article on a news site. Listening to a podcast on a different website, taking a vocabulary quiz from a textbook, etc. But inside the premium lesson program at Espresso English, you'll get everything you need in one place. When you join the program, every week I'll send you three lessons that will help you study all the areas of the language. Lesson one is based on a text. You'll practice reading and listening, as well as learn some new vocabulary and work on your writing. Lesson two is based on a dialogue, so you'll learn spoken English and you can practice your pronunciation. Lesson three is an ask the teacher lesson, where I'll clear up common questions and doubts about grammar, vocabulary, expressions, and more. This way, you can achieve balance in your English learning and make progress towards fluency. There's a special discount available if you join the premium lesson program in the month of April. The regular price for the premium lessons is thirty dollars a month, but if you register now, it's twenty dollars a month, and that's not just for the first month. You can keep the discount for as long as you want to stay a member. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you inside the premium lesson program at Espresso English.